Hi, welcome to Pictures, Noise and Words. I'm Hedgy, and this is Bloodstained Child, um, a song called Nexus. They've got a new EP. No, it's not new. What am I saying? It's like a year and a half old. Um, they've got an EP <laughs> called Nexus. So this is the song off the EP. I've known about Bloodstained Child for a long time. I had their earlier albums, Mosaic, and Idolator. So that's going back to about 2005, I think. In fact, there's a song called Pitch Black Room off Mosaic that I used to frighten people with in my car. Um, basically, anyone who, who wasn't into metal but would ask you questions about it, but they liked dance music, I would say, well, have a listen to this and, and put on Pitch Black Room. Look up Pitch Black Room by by Bloodstained Child. And quite often people who were into dance music would go, oh, that was really good because it is such a mashing together of genres, that that, that song. Um, Bloodstained Child have had, I'm not an expert on Bloodstained Child at all. They're just a band I know of and I know a little tiny bit about them, you know, and I've got their earlier albums. So I haven't heard this though. I haven't heard this at all. But they've had um, quite a history of band member changes. They they have a lady singer, and I'm not sure they've got one anymore, but they have a lady singer, and they've swapped a few of those uh, over the years. And I think some of the core members have left now. I don't even know if they're on this, to be honest. So I don't know what we're going to get, basically, because I... The last thing I got from Bloodstained Child would probably have been 2000 and, I don't know, 8 or something like that. So a lot could have happened in, in that time. No, 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 no. I got their Epsilon album, which, let's hang on. Oh, that was 2011, so I'm lying my head off. So yeah, 2011 would have been the last thing that I got, but that's still quite a while ago. Um, yeah, anyway, this is not any of those things that I just said. This is Epsilon. 2016 this song from this EP Epsilon so see what we get This is playing in HD, by the way. For some reason, the video is very soft focus. It's not. It's not my quality issue. <laughs> I was just just check then. I thought this is playing in HD. It is, but the video is made very soft.
if you're wondering why I was smiling, is because as this song was going, I'm going, yep, yeah, it's ticking all of the, uh, it's ticking the bloodstained child boxes. The, the the fast beat is exactly the tempo that bloodstained child songs go when they go quickly, and then that keyboard come in and that sound, that keyboard sound, that that's you. Go and listen to Pitch Black Room, which I mentioned earlier. It's exactly the same keyboard sound. It's a, it, This is a cookie-cutter song where they've taken elements and not changed any of them, basically. It's like, okay, that's how that's how fast this bit goes. That's how the, the vocals go, and that's how the keyboard goes. And, and ta-da, Bloodstained Child song. But I will say one thing. The, the guy in the skirt has got better legs than me. If you like that, if you're not familiar with Bloodstained Child and you like that, go and get Idolator, the album. Um, because it's just like that. It, it's That's literally what exactly, I mean exactly what I expect from a Bloodstained Child song that doesn't feature uh, female vocals. Because a lot, a lot of their other songs did. They had a, and she always sang perfectly clean, clear vocals um so yeah i mean it, it's <sighs> i like it because i like bloodstained child but i won't pretend it's anything special it's it's a bashed out bloodstained child song that ticks all of the bloodstained child boxes like i said earlier no that's not necessarily a bad thing it just like I say isn't gonna set your ipod on fire is it because there are lots of bands out there. I mean, good grief. Linkin Park have been making the same song more or less <laughs> since they started. Um, so this, if if that's what you like, then you can have more and more and more of it because they're not going off in, they're not trying to be something else, basically. So this is who we are and this is what we play. And da -da 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 -da. But that song was just so incredibly similar to previous stuff that considering this is 2016 and Idolator is 2011 so five years have passed and nothing nothing has changed in their sound I'm probably going to get Bloodstained Child fans now flaming me for daring to not say that it's amazing it's just an opinion folks it's just an opinion um, thanks for watching like I say if you did like that there's nothing wrong with it I'm not saying there's anything wrong with it if you did like that, go and get Idolator and go and get Mosaic. Um, you know, you can get this, but it's only it's only three songs on it. So um, go and get Idolator. I, I would be my recommendation. Uh, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, or even if you didn't, subscribe because I'll be doing other stuff, and I'll see you soon. Thanks. Bye bye.